Okay, further stiffening up of this front end. I think what we were finding was that when we had sidewards loadings on the tyres, the bottom ball joint position was staying still. But the top arm was raising as we went round the corners or falling, which exacerbated the camber control issues that we've been having. So if you have a look at what I've done there, I've put a couple of interconnected tie rod ends between the two joints. Obviously one's bigger than the other because the bottom ball joint which takes all the load off the springs is bigger than the top one which is just out of control. So the bottom one has got a threaded insert um, from a grinder adapter from 17mm thread to 10mm thread and that worked really well. I had the two top ball joints so it was just a case of buying a couple of 17mm um, female ball joints and a couple of grinder adapters. I already had the threaded rod. Has it worked? Yes, I believe it has and I think testing it out is the next thing I need to do. feels an awful lot more sturdy at the front end. I've had to reset the tracking and everything because the ball joints are just slightly wider than the spaces and nuts I had on before. I don't think that's going to be an issue. Um, time will tell. So next testing sessions probably early July. I'll probably take it down to Santa Pod maybe if I can get time off from home. Um, the weekend after Zoyland and I'm not going to be able to get to that. Uh, so yeah, time will tell. See if it's any better. I think it will be. It was good enough as it was last time just a little bit dramatic in some really sharp corners on rough ground. This I've got great hopes that it will have cured enough for me to conf be confident in just carrying on now. Okay that's it for this time. Goodbye.